I'm going out like this. So today we get to do something super fun that I'm so looking forward to. We get to spend all day waiting in line at the DMV. Well, that uh, that wasn't actually quite as bad as we were expecting it to be. I think we came at the right time. We were pretty much able to get right in. It was only like, what, 30 minutes maybe? It seemed less than that. Yeah, it's pretty quick. As we were leaving though, why did you just hit me in the face with the paper? I didn't mean to. I was trying to move. <laughs> Sorry, I wasn't trying to. As we were leaving though, the line was like out the front door. So I think we came at... Not really. It was pretty That's close. The front door. Well, I don't want to show the all the people. But... Show all the people. Go back in and be like, hey guys, I'm just going to record you for a few minutes. But I think we came at the right time because everyone who's coming in right now will uh, be waiting a lot longer. So, for obvious reasons, I need to cover up all the information on my license, but that's my picture. It's not too bad. So, to celebrate such a quick in and out at the DMV, we're going on a movie date. Oh. <laughs> we're going to see uh, Ralph Wrecks the Internet, or Ralph Breaks the Internet, actually, is what it's called. <laughs> I am more excited for that movie than I should be. <laughs> I am so looking forward to that movie. I like the colors. That one looks eh. I don't know about that one. So I think I've uh I think I've told this story before. I used to work here. I got a job here as a projectionist right out of high school. Worked here running the film and the projectors for four years. I used to make YouTube videos here, did you know that? Long time ago, I used to make vlogs like up in the projection booth up there. I think they're uh, I think they're still on my channel somewhere. So what'd you think of the movie? I liked it. That was good. For once, no one was on their phones or texting or talking, it was freaking annoying. Well, also <laughs> there was like us and two other people in that theater. Well, no, I think there was a family behind us because they came in and talked about Wreck It Ralph too. Oh, I liked it though. It was a uh, it was very meta. It was meta. I really liked how, I don't want to spoil anything in case anybody hasn't seen it, but a lot of Disney references in it, and I thought that was really cool. Shh. Stop. It's because I don't have my seatbelt on yet. Why are we always at Target? I wish our back porch area was a little bit bigger. It'd be nice to have something like this out there. You look like you are in an egg. I'm an egg. You'll be the most liked picture on Instagram now. Where's the donut? Stop. Oh, I turned off but yuck. Goofy's not even on there. Hey, they were just talking about bee puns in Ralph Breaks the Internet. I don't want bees on Valentine's Day. I don't like bees. They hurt. Art imitates real life. His eyes don't. <laughs> doggy. Oh, hi, doggy. <laughs> You're my favorite customer. Hey, I got, I got that for you on our first Valentine's Day. I remember pencils. Uh. What would a Thanos Valentine's card say? What was that? What would it actually say? You are a supreme friend. I am Groot. That should just say I am Groot. It shouldn't even say Happy Valentine's Day. It should just say I, I am know. Groot. Did you ever make those in your school? No. You had to bring in a shoebox and cut a hole in it and then you decorated it however you wanted and everybody traded uh, Valentine's cards. Oh, wait, maybe I don't remember that. It was probably like first or second grade. I remember one time there was like one of the popular girls in the class she, you know, you had to give uh, Valentine's cards to everybody. You couldn't leave anybody out. She dropped one on my card and it said something like, uh, it was just something like, will you be my Valentine? And then she had scratched it out and wrote just kidding on it. That's too bad. <laughs> this parking spot was made just for us. 
They should make all parking spots with dividers so that people are not hitting my car as many times as they do. So we bought these bottles. It's called Kinky and it's uh it's liqueur. And I think we're going to drink some tonight. We're going to drink some. <laughs> Two shots of vodka. <laughs> it's not actually vodka though. And before anybody says it, yes, I know. It's a girly drink. I don't care. It tastes good. It's not really meant to do shots with it, but at the same time it's not meant to have like a full glass either. I mean you can, but you don't. <laughs> it's not how like it's meant to be drank. Two shots of liquor. <laughs> you introduced me to this stuff back when we first started dating. Mm -hmm. Oh, and I remember we were uh, like on vacation somewhere at one point, weren't we? And the bar that we were at had it, and you ended up getting it at a bar. I don't know. Maybe that was a dream. <laughs> To our new house, one month later. That seems very familiar. Didn't we already do that? 